to provide them with some kind of support and some kind of identity. It helps prevent isolation. To help uh, and support dads to strengthen the connection they have with their children. Make sure that families are happy, healthy, and strong. Pernay Family Health Service is a certified home health and social service agency that was founded by the Little Sisters of the Assumption in 1968. And the mission is to strengthen and enhance family life. And we do that in a number of ways. But the history of Pernay starts in the 1800s in Paris, France, when Father Stephen Pernay went to visit a young family whose boy was not showing up to class he decided to found the Little Sisters of the Assumption because of the needs during the Industrial Revolution in Paris, France. The families had moved into the city from the countryside looking for paying jobs and they didn't have the support of extended families which is very similar to the families that we serve today in Worcester. The Family and Community Development Program at Pernay is a way of extending the clinical services that we offer to families through the programs that are contractual or that are referrals from, say, the Department of Social Services and the Department of Public Health. So what we do is we reach out to the families and provide them with extra mile opportunities. A lot of the families that we work with are obviously disadvantaged and many of them don't have a whole lot of support in their life. So people come to us after they've gone through some of the crisis interventions that we provide and they might come here, say, to use our food pantry or to access supplies for their babies or to get referrals for jobs, for other opportunities for personal development and meeting some of their family goals. I personally consider relationships and ties to family, friends, neighborhoods to be the real social security. And for many people, that social security simply doesn't exist. Often I'll ask people, well, who do you have su supporting you? And they will say, I have nobody. I'm disenfranchised from my family. I live in a neighborhood that's rather dangerous. I don't really want to get to know my neighbors. I, I don't know anybody. I don't go to a church. So I'm, I'm really alone. Can you help me out? And that's where we try to step in, Prene being a very relational kind of place, to provide them with some kind of support and some kind of identity, basically, uh, as someone who really is of value and needs some assistance, and we can provide that. We call this family and community development because we believe that people, once they're through with their, in, their individual uh, crisis and the program that brought us to Pernay, they still need ongoing support. And this program focuses on helping them to develop their own capacity to move towards self-sufficiency as a family. And also the neighborhood piece, we say it's family and community development. Pernay tries to be a presence in this Green Island neighborhood to the people who live here, who work here, and who are obviously some of the most needy people in our city. Our family and community development program is funded by primarily through different donations and foundations and through the Partners in Charity program. The only paid staff member is myself and everyone else who works in this program is a volunteer. So it shows that we really do bring in a lot of people into this program and people have great confidence in the work that we're doing. The volunteers and these other donations, the monetary donations, the donations of goods and services are really the lifeline of what we're trying to offer people through the Family and Community Development Program. The mission is the same today, to strengthen and enhance family life. That is the mission of Prene Family Health Service, as well as the Little Sisters of the Assumption. And what we do is we focus on home visiting in all of our programs. We provide maternal child health nursing visits. We provide family, vi family home visiting for families that have many different needs. The Homemaker Program is a program that we have homemakers that go into the homes of disabled adults and do light housekeeping chores such as dusting, vacuuming, floor care, grocery shopping, laundry, basically anything that allows 
the individual to remain in their home. The homemakers that we have right now are mostly young moms who enjoy the flexibility that homemaking offers. Um, we fortunately have employed one or two clients that were clients of Prenet and other programs and that has worked out really well. It's benefited them and given them an opportunity to join the job force and it's helped out my program a lot. One of the biggest benefits is it helps prevent isolation. Um, many times the homemaker 